Hi guys, today we're gonna talk about 3, maybe 3.5 useful websites for Rust. You might know them all, maybe not, and I bet you don't know them all. What do I bet? Let's say nothing. So first, this is my first video fully done in English, except for my little short movie. So please guys, be cool with my French baguette accent. So let's jump right into it. We start with the one you all know, I think, it's Rustafeed. Why is it so good then? Because it gives you infos on the next update, like two or three days before the dev blog. They have a great bunch of different servers, and they have some big guides too. The second one is just my favorite one. I always wanted to make an Android or iOS application like this, but I just don't know how to do it, so now I just have uh, the YouTube money I gave up. This website is rustlabs.com. It's just amazingly done. You have a full wiki on each weapons, resources, animals of the games, etc, etc. No, 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 that's not all. They are working on even more useful functions like a calculator. You tell him what you want, like 5C4 or maybe some rockets to go with it, and it will give you the exact amount of what you need. If you already began to farm, just add it in these tabs. It will just remove what you already have from the recipe. The third one is, let's say, I don't know anyone who knows it, and it's pretty sad, especially for builders. This is a little website named wallstack.rustcreations.com. If you have to make a new base with some double doors, etc., you just have to go on this site, and it will give you the exact amount of the thing I just can't pronounce that you need. It will obviously show you the thickness of the gap between the foundations. This is really really useful for people like me with the cerebral capacity of a goldfish. It's been made by a guy named ScriptZ, and I highly recommend you to check him out on Twitter. He makes really 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 interesting content on Rust. So this is the last one, the 3.5. Why is it just half? Because you might not really see why I show you this if you're not an admin or something like this. This website, rustmonitor.com, is made to see like who is working or not in the Facepunch office, which servers are down, how many players are connected and when is the moment where there is the minimum or maximum amount of players. It even shows you the recent reports of cheaters. The website itself is really really well done, but it's not that useful enough to make it a useful website for all players. So this is already the end of this video. I'm really really sorry for my accent, but I think the more I practice and the best it will be. Maybe I did make English mistakes, and if I did just tell me, I'll take care of it, and whatever, I'll always make subtitles for you to understand if my English is really too bad. So it's time to say goodbye people and we'll see you in the next one. And of course if you liked it, just drop a like, a comment, subscri uh, subscribe if you want, and we'll see you soon. Bye!